So here we're given this uh, frequency graph, and what I'm going to do is to just assign these values to these consecutive positive integers. You can just use 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. And these frequencies also, um, I can just call this 1, and then this would be 3, this would be 4, 3, um, and, and the answer would scale with that. So whatever answer we get for the comparison would be the same. So the first thing, easiest thing to do is to find the mode, the most frequently occurring value, which is C, or in my case, 3. Median, here we have 16 values, if you add these, 4, 8, 11, 13, 16, and we need to find the average of the middle 2. So if I take out the middle 2, I have 14 left, so 7 on both sides. So I'm looking at the average of the 8th and 9th value. So here... 1 plus 3, 4, plus 4 is 8. Eighth value is 3. And ninth value would be 4. So average of 3 and 4 is 3.5. So that's the median. And then to calculate the mean, I have to do the weighted average. So the sum would be here. First value would be 1 times 1. 2 times 3. 3 times 4 plus 4 times 3, plus 5 times 2, and then just 6, 7, and 8, because we just have one of these. And then we divide this by 16. So that's 15, 21, 31, and 12 is 43, and 12, 55, and 6, 61, and 1, 62. So 62 over 16, or 31 over 8, which is 8 times 3 is 24, 3 and 7 eighths. So mean is 3 and 7 eighths. So we notice here mean is the greatest, then median, then mode is the least. So if you look at the answer choices, mode is less than the median, which is true, and the median is less than the mean. So yeah, that works. Answer is choice A.